What up, man? Also, your boy Shocker360 from manos.com, and here we go with the Nico 335 Crash 2. And we're gonna go ahead and use the Bluff Blitz feature, the one we used on the 34 defense on our last video. So, we're gonna go ahead and use it here with the 335, and it works really well. At the same time, you're gonna have great coverage. As you guys can see here, we're setting up our play, and uh, we're baselining press right there. and uh, we're doing a couple of steps, but I'm just going to show you how it looks. It looks a lot better than this. I forgot one step here to do, but uh, I'm going to show you guys exactly what I'm doing so you guys can go ahead and practice this and use it in the game. So what we're going to do here is base a line press. Then we're going to go ahead and pinch the line crash down, re-blitz the DT. Then we're going to go ahead and bluff blitz the right outside linebacker in the middle linebacker. And as you guys saw there, we got the nice B gap just straight to the quarterback. Make sure you got a good defensive end. Again, we're going to go ahead and base the line press. Uh, pinch D line crash down, re blitz the DT, both blitz the right outside linebacker in the middle linebacker, and we get another B gap as you guys can see there. Now, notice that I actually set it up pretty quick, guys. It's gonna probably take you guys some time, so it is a lot of steps, it's more advanced, but it, it will get the job done there. As you guys can see here, we already have everybody set up. We are already, all we have to do right now is just baseline and uh, press. I'm gonna put the setup on the description also, so you guys can practice the setup. And again, we're gonna go ahead and, and send that B gap once again. Sometimes you even get a B gap and an A gap at the same time. So real quick, we're gonna go ahead and base a line, press, pinch D line, crash down, re blitz the DT, bluff blitz the right outside linebacker and middle linebacker. And that's pretty much it. Grab the safety over the top. You could even hold L2 or left trigger and we get the nice B gap there. Make sure you also have a fast defensive end with good acceleration. That guy wasn't really good, but uh, you know, he still got the job done there. So to later guys, let me know what you guys think about this formation. How is this bluff blitz uh, feature working for you? Is it not working for you? Let me know here in the comment section. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more. To later is your boy Shock360 from Manos.com. Bye. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down here below for more tips, more strategies, more schemes, more gameplays, more tournaments, and more giveaway prices. Later, it's your boy Shock360. Hit that like button. Don't forget, comment, and subscribe.